Can someone please think of the children? Hey everybody, Forrest from 2 Bats Gaming here, and I'd like to welcome you to our playthrough of Dreamwell, an abstract strategy game published by Action Phase Games. Dreamwell is designed by Nick Little and illustrated by hugely popular artist Tara McPherson. A quick note, this is just our playthrough of Dreamwell. If you're interested in the gameplay concepts as well as our opinion of the game, we invite you to go check out our full review of Dreamwell, also available on this channel. Anyways, let's jump right in. Tonight's setup is two players, our classic matchup of me versus Rachel. We hope you enjoy, and thanks for watching. Hey everybody, what's up? I'm Forrest. And I'm Rachel. And we are trying to record our first playthrough of Dreamwell. Let's see how everything goes. If we fuck up the rules too bad, please don't yell at us. It is our first time. We're nervous. <laughs> Alright, cool. Let's go. Alright, so, looking at what I need to get to. All right, my first dude, my first action is going to be one movement there. My next action is going to be one movement here, and because it's got the door, I can move additionally. So I'm going to stop right there. And then I am going to turn in this card, which is a little skull and a little black blob of some sort. <laughs> Thanks, Tara McPherson. <laughs> And I've got the right background and everything, so I get one point per some other pair, and I can move to the pink elephant if I choose. Yeah, by the way, you don't have to do the action if you don't want to. Okay. The thing on the card, the <clears> effect. <throat> um, do I want to move to the pink elephant? No, you know what? I think I am good. All right, your turn. Okay. I'm going to move my first balloon onto that. Okay. And my second balloon, I'm going to go in there on the little skull flower. Okay. God, I love her art. It's yeah, so it really cute. Is good. It is cute. It's so cute. Yeah. Um, okay. And so then I can turn that one in. So you got the right background, you got the bunny, you got the skull. Heck yeah. Yeah. So that gets you four points, and as long as that's your topmost friend card, it's going to act like you have the white thing. Wolf. Thing. Yeah. Oh, there's a name. Borealis. Borealis. And that Excellent. is Skullflower, by the way. See? All right. Cool. So you've got one more action. And I'm going to draw another friend card. Okay. I'm going to get that one. Cool. So I'm going to take a new one off the top of the deck. All right. You good? I'm good. Cool. Mmm. This is quite a pinky little game. Okay, so first up, I'm going to rotate this tile like that. And then I'm going to spend one movement to get me there, two movement to get me there, and then third, I think I'm good on this. Yeah, I've got the background, I've got the skull flower, and I've got, what's the bunny called? Jupiter. I've got Jupiter. So... I'm going to turn that in, and that lets me replace the display and draw a card from it. Okay, and so I need to draw a card. Yeah, I'm going to draw that one. All right, baby, it's your turn. Okay. All right, I'm going to move this guy. Mm -hmm. hmm. So the only way you can actually move <laughs> there is off the board. Or, or diagonal, diagonal. Yeah. yeah. Don't forget you can rotate tiles. Right. All right, one. Mm -hmm. Rotate that one. Two. two. Three. Awesome. Okay. So that's your turn? Yeah. Okay, cool. So, first things first, I'm actually going to turn this one in. Because I have everything I need. Oh, no, I don't. I'm sorry. I'm incorrect. Um, 
But if I move there one turn, two, turn that in, and that lets me move to Borealis. Do any of them leave Borealis? No, they don't. Shoot. Well, screw it. I'll move there anyways. Um, I'll move <laughs> this dude here. Wait. Yeah, to that one. And then for my third action, I'm going to draw this. Okay. Cool. Your turn. I'm going to do one, mm -hmm. two, okay. three. Okay. You good? Yeah. Awesome. So, Bunny, am I on the right background? I am indeed. So, I'm going to go ahead and turn this one in. Um, it's seven points if I have three of that combo right there. Okay. The Astra and Orbit combo. That Chicky and the Wolf. Or whatever it is. <laughs> Chicky and the Wolf. Chicky and the Wolf. It's like that old wolf song. Or old land song. <clears throat> so that's one action. Two. Three. Okay. I'm good. Okay. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and play that card. Okay, so you've got... The... Gets me three points it per, what is it, ace or ion. Yeah. And I've got a black swan if I want it. Okay. Um, and yeah, let's double check and make sure you're on everything you need. Yeah, starry background, pink elephant, and bunny. Awesome. Cool. Cool. All right, so that was one action. Mm -hmm. Two, but it's two open doors. So, that... so you can move again. Okay. But, but does I don't the tile want to. let you? Uh, yeah. Okay, so you're good? Yeah. Okay. Three, mm -hmm. I'm going to turn that one in. Okay. Cool. So, so that's five points if I have yeah. three of the asteroid in orbit. Mm -hmm. So, an important point if you want to stack your cards kind of like yeah. I have, it's only the, la the effect of the last card you played. Okay. So, you only have located the skull flower right, right. now. This, the other ones don't, don't matter anymore. Don't matter. Was that your three actions? Yep. Okay, cool. So my turn? Mm hmm Awesome. Hmm, let me consider. Yeah, okay. So my first action, I'm going to rotate this sucker. Second action, I'm going to come visit you. Hi. Hi. Third action, I'm going to play that card. So I get five points again if I have that combo, the same combo as this one, that combo, the Astrid and Astra and Orbit, and I get to immediately move off the board. Now, does that mean both my... It says immediately move off the board. I'm guessing that means everything okay. for me. So, dink. And that's my three actions. Okay. So, one, I'm going to okay. take a new friend. Two, mm -hmm. three. Awesome. You good? Yes. Cool. Okay. One, I'm going to take that. Two, I'm going to walk in the board here. And three, I'm going to walk in the board here. I am good. Okay. So, okay, I got the skull flower from that. And then I've got the, the night elephant. elephant, so I can play that. Mm -hmm. And it's yeah. a wild card. Yeah. So, so you can count it as another pair later. For instance, when we do in-game scoring, you could count it as one of those to get an extra point. Mm -hmm. Or you could count it one of those if you had, like, two other. Mm -hmm. And I can move to a C. If you choose. Background. Yeah. Now you lose the skull flower effect. Right. I'm going to move this one to here. Cool. Okay. You good? I'm good. Awesome. All right. So, first things first, I'm actually going to turn this one in. I've got the sea background, the pink whale, and the skull flower. So, honestly, I keep on turning in cards, and I don't think they're the best ones for me to turn in, but screw it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't um, know what I'm doing yeah, yet. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> um, so that considers located the, I guess that's a swamp or something, a cave. 
Um, that's my first action. Green cave. Green cave. Cool. Thank you. Second action. I need a little three eye dudes. Yeah. Two. Little hero. Little hero. Is that his name? Yes. And three. He's woke. He is woke. <clears throat> Alright, cool, dude. Your turn. Okay. One. Oh, that's you. That's me. Mm. Two, three. Awesome. You good? <clears throat> I am good. All right. So, yeah, I'm just going to have to go one, two, and then three I'm going to come in on this time. Okay, I'm good. All right. So I can play that one because mm -hmm. I've got Black Swan Watery. Yeah. Little Hero. Cool. Doesn't matter where he is. Awesome. That's one. I've got another skull flower if I want it, but that's kind of useless at the moment. Yeah. Two. So I can walk off, but mm -hmm. I can't walk back on again yet. Uh, how many actions do you have left? One. Then, yeah, you could just walk okay. off. Yeah. I'm walking off. Okay, cool. You good? I knew the world was flat. <laughs> and hollow. <laughs> And I have touched the sky. And I have touched the sky. <laughs> if you get that reference, you're our type of people. <laughs> and I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, don't leave the basement. It's not safe there. All right. You good? Yes. Cool. So first one, I'm going to rotate this one and screw up the whole row. Second action, I'm going to walk here. And third, I'm going to play this card, which is my seven frames. No! However, you do get a turn. Okay. You get one more turn because I went first. So, one, two, three, four, five, yeah. All right, take your last turn. I mean, I'm still not going to win, but yeah, maybe. I'm going to walk back on for one. Okay. Two, turn, turn that in. in. Cool. Perform mm. a draw action, that's kind of useless. Three. Well, no, get a draw card and you might just be able to Just in case. Yeah. Oh, is the draw action just from the top? Either one. Either one? Yeah. I didn't actually look at it. That's fine. First game and all. Oh, I got it. I got it. A pink, a pink whale. whale in the sky <laughs> and a black swan under the sea. They're in the completely wrong place. You two nope, are confused. They are not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's there's something very strange going on in Terry McPherson's head. Yes, there is. Oh, useless. Okay, I'm going to draw it. Oh, it's still chance. useless. Still useless? Okay. All right, cool. So, time to score the game. So, I'll tell you what. Let me grab a piece of paper. Okay. Okay, so why don't we have you go first? Okay, so first you've got four points. We know that. We just want to do the hearts first. Well, yeah, whatever. Oh, I guess it definitely depends. Yeah. Four for that. Okay, then you get three per any of those dudes you have. Uh, so you've I have got none. one. Well, you've got one because he's. No, on that's the not the same one. It isn't the same no. dude? Oh, you're right. He's got. No, yours. that's Lucius. Okay. Ah, so no points for that? Nope. Okay. Um, next one, five if you got three of those. And I do. Because you have a wild card, don't you? I have three anyway. Oh, wow. Excellent. So I'll show you a trick in a minute. You could actually get some points for that. But okay. So that's five points for that combo. Now let's go back to this card real quick. See how this oh, is a wild card? It's so wild. you can count it as one of them. Yeah, So that's okay. going to be an extra three points. Then she doesn't count, I think. No, she gets two points on her own. Yeah. Yeah. And then finally, just another four-point card, correct? And two. Yeah, yeah, so four six. points and two, so six extra points. So that's going to be 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. You have 20 points. All right, let's figure out mine. I think you're going to kick my ass. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. One per those combos. I'm going to go, ah, screw it, we'll go from left to right. Okay, so there's four for that. 
two per that combo. Neither. I, I have none of them. Five if I have three of those. I do not. Seven if I have three of those. I do not. <laughs> That's worth three points. That dude's worth two points. And that one is worth one if I have that combo, which I do not. Awesome. That's going to be a total of nine points. <laughs> I clearly have no idea how the concept of this game works. Yay! And I'm going for accidental combos. Big game. That was a good game. All right, this is fun. Cool, yeah, I take it. I